The Woody Show. Now, Greg, let me ask you, of everything that's on Greg's list, Uh what's the one that upsets you the most? That upsets me the most? Yeah, I mean, you're triggered by all of it. I'm triggered because a lot of them, like I mentioned before, a lot of them do belong on that list. Right, Things so what, I don't understand or don't work for me. Wi-Fi. I'll, I'll give you two. What, what two upset you the most? Well, using the word upset is wrong. It's just inaccurate. Uh, but let's say, uh, great <laughs> rebuttal, uh, chimney right. caps. That just makes no sense. You've okay. ever gone to use a screwdriver. You go to do whatever you're working on. And you go, oh, I need a flat one, not a Phillips head. So therefore, you don't understand screwdrivers. Like it's this. It okay, so literally chim- makes no sense. Chimney caps. Somebody who claims to be in Mensa should know better. I do. I have a plaque. Um, have you ever cut yourself with a knife, sea bass, or fallen off a bike? Didn't you break your back? I I cut myself with a knife when I was a little kid. I was slicing well, I, bread and had to get put stitches. Knives on your list, so you don't understand <laughs> knives. Like the petty egg, I went too hard with it, and I and I made. Oh, mess. that's right. You're so brilliant. I don't understand how to use it. Eggs. Yeah. You screwed up. So you don't understand. Right. Well, I'm putting knives. Well, let's put knives on. All right, so <laughs> chimney caps. And what's, what's, what's the other one? Uh, well, petty egg. Chinese food, for example. I was looking at a recipe. I wanted to make homemade Chinese food. Didn't turn out that well. Mm. Therefore, I don't understand Chinese food. Because you guys are all master chefs, and everything you cooked <laughs> is perfect. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, uh, what else? I asked you for there? two. That's fine. I like the okay. free in-store pickup. Oh, quarantining. You You've never been to my house and never will, so you don't understand <laughs> the layout of my house and why I quarantined where I quarantined. Uh, that was where... So I that think... means I don't understand quarantine. You picked the room with no TV. Yeah, when, yeah. when Greg got coronavirus. Oh, that's right. right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Again, because Mario the guest like room a... is at the very end of the house, and yeah. the, the uh, primary bedroom is right in the middle where the bathroom and everything is. He did not have COVID. Yeah. So he still had to go about his day and life. I could be at the far end of the house all by myself, away from everything. But like, why so couldn't he have had the I rest d- of the house and then use the guest room to sleep? Right. For example, Our at closet least, at is least... in there. His clo- he would have to come in to get his clothes. Okay. Well, everything. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, we, we don't have to go back. So I'm you're interested... making my point for me. I'm interested you, in. That doesn't mean I don't understand it. Greg, it's just babe, so dumb. Babe, babe. How's the guest room don't have a TV? You know right. what I'm saying? <laughs> that's, that's medicine. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I, I can put a TV placement on yeah, there. Yeah, I put a yeah. TV in the no bathroom. Sense. It's pretty yeah. ghetto. Who would want a guest in there? It's yeah. pretty ghetto. Uh, okay, so uh, Greg, what do you have? Because you've mm. uh, constructed Ooh. a sea bass list. <laughs> is this sea bass's actual license picture? I don't know. I found that on That's his, funny. Whatchamacallit? My Twitter? Uh, maybe Facebook? This? Mm. Yeah, that's oh, that's my old license plate, not license photo, uh, driver's say. license. Yep. Yeah, I, I got a My Little Pony tattoo on my face, and I was like, they'll never let me. Oh yeah, they would. Oh, they did. Because <laughs> everybody can do anything these days. Yeah, yeah uh-huh. sure. Why not? Well, we just added today naming things versus creating things, just because you came up with a concept and somebody else came up with the name. Oh, oh somebody else came up with the name, so you don't understand naming things. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but first and foremost on the list of things that actually belong on this list. Number one is slang. He doesn't understand slang. He's always hates like doggo, kiddo, Karen, bussin, no yeah. cap, stuff like that. And he goes, and I'll, here's my Seabass imitation. Nobody was saying this 10 years ago. <laughs> That's how slang works, idiot. Like Shakespeare didn't say dude. And right. Bill Clinton wasn't like, no cap. <laughs> you know? <laughs> That's how language evolves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, as little as two years ago, Seabass didn't say, thank you every mm-hmm. nine seconds right, that's, that's how slang true. works that's because so we had a he, we had a thought leader in studio he, he mm-hmm. doesn't understand yeah. slang yeah I do uh no you don't it's on the list <laughs> closing doors have you guys noticed that every time there's background noise we're trying to do a show it's because he can't close the door and we've told him a thousand oh, times the studio door yeah. yeah close the studio door because it's loud out there it is mm-hmm. a dumb design so he doesn't well, understand ex- doors can I explain that it's yeah. because the studio door has no a you don't you know it's on the list well, <laughs> nope you don't get to rebut much like i never did you yeah, can try, you, you don't know how to close a door. No, it's got a magnetic try. lock, and if you don't very quietly close it, it'll slam, which is obviously a worse sound to have in the studio, a slamming door. Sure. Right, and when you come in during a of song noise. or a commercial break, when it doesn't matter if the mics are on, you still don't close it. Yeah, so it let's put closing doors on that right. list. Closing All doors. Right. That is on number the li- two on the on list. On the list, mm-hmm. Sorry, buddy. Oh, he got me good. Yep. <laughs> Plumbing. Remember when he tried installing a toilet and he broke everything and flooded oh, his place? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Doesn't understand plumbing or toilets. That was Jackson. That's totally... Okay, oh, interesting. But you didn't get it. Thank no, you. That was an accident. Kind of like a petty egg was an accident. <laughs> or 
Or the Chinese food so, not yep, turning Chinese out. food not turning Chimney out great. <laughs> so how about this? Okay, let's put this list on my list of things he doesn't understand. I already put that on your list, Greg, yeah. m- years ago. The one that I created. Thanks for stealing it. All right. Uh, <laughs> so plumbing this came and up, toilets. This just came up. Character development. Ooh. He doesn't understand that. Like, What does that mean? If yeah. I said- I mean, I know what it is. In this but like, room. Okay. Um, we're talking about Harry Potter and hockey. Who would, who would that refer to? Re- um. Ravy. Wild yeah. get, thank you. Well, maybe uh, immature humor or violent TV shows. Uh, Woody. Pat McAfee. Oh, there you go. Okay. Maybe uh, wine or fancy food and home uh, improvement stuff. Menace. Like, get, get it. it. <laughs> Greg. Or malls traveling. Yeah, that's menace. Music. Yeah. Right. But then out of the blue, let's come up with a segment uh, like book, r- book club of the month with for voracious readers only with Woody and Menace. And that's what he doesn't get. Like, out of the blue, if friends made Joey the smart one, like what? You just spent 10 years making him the dumb one. And so what's your example? How does this relate to C? Because, because he came up with that segment. Uh, let's do a segment, who pulled a Greg recently? And we did a whole call in thing like, oh my God, I put on two different socks. I pulled a Greg. Because that's what I'm known for, being <laughs> that dumb. So he's been holding <laughs> on to that for like a year and a half. <laughs> And by the way, that was, like, that was so a long getting. time ago. <laughs> and by the way, that well, was also... Well, because I have a good memory, let's fault me for that. And by the way, also, that was a Woody inspiration. See, a lot of these things I'm getting flack on, like Greg's list, when Woody, behind the scenes, is the one pulling all the strings, but I'm doing the execution, so Greg doesn't understand, like, don't shoot the messenger. I'll put that on well, his no, list. Well, no, he said that he I came up it. with the list. I, I did. Yeah, Greg came up with the list. But Woody said to me, hey, like, maybe, like Craig's list, Greg's list, and you yeah. can fill it in, and that's what we did. Oh, yeah. so Woody stole it from me. No, I said once. Once we had, I told him to get the print out, yeah, the print so we can add things to yeah. it. So kind of like those things, like things uh, to it. How many, how like many accident, free, accident-free days on the work yeah. side? Like have Greg you not yeah. getting papery. Right. Like I don't mm-hmm. get it. It's, it's, yeah. It literally makes no sense. I still don't coming know from somebody. That is. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So Paprika. we got we got slang. Uh-huh. We got closing doors, plumbing and toilets. He doesn't get it. Character mm-hmm. development. Because right. one segment. <laughs> okay. What else is on Thank Seabass's list? Well, because of one incident on mine, that's on my list. How do, how do you Fair like point, it? Fair point, Greg. Right? Fair point, Greg. Thank you. One right. time, well, I, I like that go too hard mm-hmm. with the petty egg. All right. So what's, that's what's how it works, Seabass. Hope you like it. Uh, being classy. So his party was great. Lots of food. Yeah. Lots yeah. of drinks. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Very attentive and all that. Dinner jacket. But you negate the classy, much like you negate a joke when you go, see, here's why the joke is funny. You explain the punchline. You negate the classy when you tell people constantly, I ordered pizzas, but you don't feel, have to feel free to eat them. I will keep them. So don't feel free, don't feel like you have to eat them. You negate the classy when you say, I have all these drinks, but I'm going to keep them afterwards. So, you know, and then saying how classy you are negates the classy. Mm. It totally negates the classy. Because that wasn't part of the bit. Well, what's the... Oh, see, that, well, there's your excuse. Well, I put on a, a freaking tuxedo jacket. He had his jacket. dinner jacket on. <laughs> that uh, was classy. All right. Basically, wait, 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 negates put that on Greg's the, list. Yeah, so wait, what was the... I'm, I'm trying to understand the pizza thing. Help me understand that. He said no fewer than 19 times. Don't feel like you have to eat well, it. If we don't eat it, I'm going to keep it. Yeah, I just interpreted right. that to be like, don't like feel food. It's not going to go to waste. Yeah, right. Yeah. right. Like, don't feel obligated. Just right. Why here, have like, to say it so many it. times? Why do you have to say it so many times? You're negating the whole point. Well, I think 19 is a bit it's, of a... It's much like... Okay. It's, a, it's an understatement. It was hyperbole. probably 50. <laughs> Let's put hyperbole on Seabass's list. I mean, Woody and Raby were both there, and they kind of got the point, obviously, because yeah. they're not obtuse. Yeah, well, I, I again, See? my, look my at, interpretation. Look how he's lashing out. My interpretation when the list like, is about him and pointing out the obvious things he absolutely doesn't understand. Because my wife and I were going to dinner it. afterwards, right? And mm. they, they were, the pizza was there, and so you don't want to be rude, exactly. But it was a good thing you were reminded so many times. I'm, I am glad he said it. Yeah. Thank you. Maybe okay, not good. 19, 20 times, but right. And then let's put self-deprecation on the list. Happen. He wouldn't know how to be self-deprecating if he had a gun to his head. He's never been self-deprecating. You say like, wow, Greg, you're a gay whale. I say gay whale, more like a gay pregnant whale who just gained 50 pounds mm-hmm. and right. is pregnant mm-hmm. with triplets. You say something negative about sea bass. <laughs> oh, that's not true. That's not true. Well, that's not true. Well, no, I just explained it. You're up too. Can never, ever just be self-deprecating. So that is, that maybe that should be number one on the list. Although <laughs> slang is by far number one on the list. So. All right, slang. So we got slang, class. closing doors, plumbing, character, yep, development, character development, being classy, um, self-deprecation, and how to compile a list of pertinent things because his list doesn't make any sense. All right, well, there's Seabass's list, everybody. I, like that. I mean, how do you spell obtuse? <laughs> <laughs>
take take a shot. You Mattis. T- you try it. Yeah. What, what, what did you guess first? Uh, obtuse. O p t u s. Obtuse. It's not op tuse. Well, well, you can uh, put the ob. You could put the shower on there, Greg. Because oh, yeah. he's using it to poop. That's true. It doesn't understand It's not showers. for pooping. Right. Somebody on the text. Uh, I love how this segment, Greg is trying to get a negative reaction out of Seabass, but Greg sounds like the one who's having Greg's a bad time. I know. Greg's the one that's going to have a yeah, hard time. Well, because we're talking about mine. <laughs> I need to put you're emo- still closing your ears. Uh, I need today. to put emotional yeah. control on Greg's one because he's, uh, he's not um, going to do that, obviously. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Oh, I found it. Greg and Seba should just scissor already. <laughs> yeah. Agreed. I know you guys are used to trolling Greg because he gets irritated so easily, but it almost feels like harassment now. Yeah, mm. I'm, I'm, I'm starting to agree with that. Well, let's not forget, this is light compared to Greg literally what almost quit several times back in the oh, old Woody true. Show days. Oh, that hell yeah. That was because of Menace. That menace. Was, <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. That I can't tell you. That was video of the water. There, what oh, do you think yeah. there were more of? More instances of you pulling me aside and having a conversation <laughs> about Menace or Seabass reminding everybody about the pizza that didn't need to be eaten? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> which one? The pizza. Because. By far. I think I complained about Menace to you one on one. He needs to get know. out of here. Three times. <laughs> he goes, just Who fire is him. This guy? <laughs> Why is he here? He <laughs> serves no purpose. He makes no sense. <laughs> yeah, but then we became friends. Yeah, then we yeah. became buddies. So right. there is hope out there, guys. No, there's, there's hope. There's yeah. Yeah. I don't know. No, there's not. All right, we're going to take a, a quick break. And you know, if anything, this is uh, very therapeutic for Greg. Yeah. It gives him a chance to That's rebut. True. Gives him a and chance to, to, to lash prove, out. To mathematically prove how stupid that list was. Yeah. <laughs> and how CBS doesn't know how to compile lists. <laughs>